You know, I've never been in a hall of horns before. And man, they've got them here. Look at them. Deer, deer everywhere. There's a double, double rack here. Oh, they're fighting. That's what they're doing. Hall of horns. Hey, look at this one right here. Something in it. Look at this one right here. It's got a little prong that sticks down. All of horns. Look at these uh, arrow arrowheads. Even more spearheads. More horns. Reindeer. Elk. Moose. Deer, 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 moose, moose, bar, reindeer. Oh boy, look over here. We got uh, we got a mountain goat, bighorn sheep, pronghorns. Man, those things are huge. Look how big they are. South Texas Ice Age, 13,230 years ago. I got some unusual creatures here. Big bison. Giant ground sloth. Columbian mammoth. Giant bisons. Agar. Alligator sharks. Camelops. short legged llamas. Giant short faced bear. Mountain lion. This is an Indian antelope at home in South Texas. So, what does that mean? We're native to the scrublands of India and Pakistan, standing from three, are the largest species of Asian antelopes. An Asian antelope from the breeding stock of the King Ranch. Today, 10,000 thrive on the King Ranch, Narias Division. All right, here we go. The chap Mesquite Chaparral is one of the most diverse plant communities in North America. The diversity is reflected in a variety of abundance of animals and habitat. The pig like Javelina, or Carlin Pecanary, is common resident of the mesquite chaparral. Unlike many other herbivores, it is not every man for himself. When danger threatens, Havelina, a javelina troop, when confronted with a small cadaver such as a coyote, the adult male actively defends the rest of the troop. They look like a pig and they smell like a skunk. <laughs> That's a mascot. All right, we got the uh, armadillo, turkey, turkey, skunks. Seen plenty of dead skunks. Deer, deer. There's a king snake. Cotton was a chief row crop from 1900 to 1950. Large farms require big equipment, some kind of buzzer. All right. The dry chaparral flora. Most common dry shrubland associated is the black brush twisted arcadia. Twisted arcadia. Black brush, nasty, nasty thorns there, huh? Galicious is nearby.
dry scrublands, often called chaparral, are common throughout South Texas. They occur on those sites with, with little available soil moisture. Most common ecological feature causing low soil moisture is shallow soil. Eat prickly pears. You know, I think Texas must be the prickly pear capital of the flowers. Here's your mesquite. Creosote bush. Prickly pears. Line. Turkey vulture. Jackrabbit, dead deer, Butter making. The homestead. Got a good old, good old stove with a coffee pot. Ironing board, table. Baby. Baby uh, mobile. Cabinet. This has a rope, boots, boot jack. All right, these are all the brands of the different ranches. Brandon Irons. Horsehair rope. Rawhide Rita. Chuck wagon. Look at a cotton bag. So you tied it around your waist or you put it over your shoulder and you dragged it. Knee pads. Middle player buster. Cotton was picked by hand and dragged in a 10 to 12, 15 foot long cotton sacks to the weight master's beam as the cotton scale where it was weighed. It usually required over 1,000 pounds of raw cotton to make a 500 pound bale of gin processed cotton. Chuck wagon. Pulls down. There's all your ingredients right there. There's your grinder on the side. Man, would you look at this longhorn steer. Dehorners. These were used to cut the horns off the young calves, requiring them, making them easier to work with. The pair was manufactured in 1892.